Hey guys, welcome back. As you can see, I'm outside on a pretty nice day here in the backyard. I got this board up here where I do my spray painting. So, I'm just going to use some of this uh, paint and uh, just try not to go overboard on it and just kind of a little bit of splatters here and there. Let's see how it looks. Alright, watch this. Just kind of go with the flow, yo. Let's slap it down. Just kind of go with the flow, yo. Another thing you want to remember is to uh, keep your spray paint farther away so you just get like a splatter kind of technique. Just kind of hold it about six inches away from the canvas. You should get a good uh, spray. I'm out of my yellow. Let's move on to some orange. Here we go. Just kind of adds that uh, another layer of shadow. It's like a shady effect. Now let's go with some blue. This is a darker blue, so you want to be careful not go crazy with it. We're going to do some shapes here. And last color, I'm going to use some white. Just to kind of balance it up. Here we go. Gives it like a misty kind of look. There, I think that's about it. Now we can move on. I did bring another canvas out, so I'm going to uh, get that prepared too. I want to do two of these paintings. I'm going to whip down some blue. Bam, 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 bam. I'm holding it back about seven or eight inches. Just kind of feeding it along. This is going to be my background to something cool. That should be good. You don't want to go overboard. Now I'm going with my orange. Just going to fill in some of these. Get a little bit of splatter going on. We're just uh, creating a background here for a new painting. And uh, stick with me on the journey and uh, we'll see how it turns out together. Usually I don't have any ideas for a painting, so just kind of go with the flow, yo. It's looking cool. Let's get some drips. To get drips with the spray paint, hold it really close and spray it all out. There we go. Look at those drippies coming. We'll leave it there. And some white to counterbalance. There we go, I think that's about it. Just kind of go with the flow, yo. Let's slap it down. Just kind of go with the flow, yo. Let's slap it down. Just kind of go with the flow, yo. Let's slap it down. Let's slap it down. Hey guys, I'm back. It's Rayard from outside. I was uh, spray painting these paintings right here. Here they are. Look at what you can see here. I see something going on. And Flash over here. I spray painted some of this. It looks a little uh, fady weighty. But that's okay. We're going to bring it up, make a pop, make a jump. Let's slap it down. Let's roll that time lapse. <laughs> Oh wow, what the heck happened here? That's craziness. <laughs> That's how I slap it down, folks. I am rare. 
This is, uh, I don't know what the heck these are, but I like it. That is cool. See, that's what I mean. It just comes about, just slap it down. You're just painting away and something magic happens. And this is what happened here, guys. I like these. I think I like this one better than this one. But I don't know if these are done. I was going to have a, a white paint marker. I'm going to try to bring that out, slap it down. Hey, guys, I'm back. Uh... I just want to say I'm not done with this paintings yet. You know what I gotta do? I got one of these sharper Sharpie uh, paint markers and uh, this is actually the first time I've ever used a white one. I usually use silver which is this kind. Not this brand but uh, I'll give them a shot see how they work. What you gotta do is shake 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 them up and then you gotta uh, dab the uh, paint down. I'm sure some of you have used these before. So we're going to just uh, slap it down over here at the Rare Art Studios, uh, add some whites, make this pop out even more, more, more. All right, without further ado, let's roll that time lapse. I'm out of here. So guys, what do you think? I think they turned out pretty dang cool. What do you think? Got some craziness going on in here. Oh yeah, some craziness, I tell ya. That's how we do it here at the Rare Art Studios. Just slap it down and you make something insane happen out of this paint and markers. Anyway, I really like this uh, Sharpie paint marker. It's a white, medium point, oil-based, opaque paint marker. It is fantastic. I'd highly recommend getting one. Doing some nice outlines. I like doing the white on the blacks or even on the pinks. It looks really good. So anyway, thanks for tuning in. Uh, I'll probably... Uh, actually, these paintings are going into an art gallery. Possibly I'm, I'm uh, entering them into uh, the art rental gallery here in London. We'll see if they pick them up. If not, I'll throw them up on eBay or something. But uh, 24 by 30 inch, both of them. That's two... Very nice. Uh, thanks for tuning in to another episode of Ray Art. Live painting and some time lapse here and there. Uh, don't forget to subscribe, favorite, and share. And like this one. Alright, talk to you guys later. Peace out.